boys and girls, this is Miss Shannon, and I have our next story in our series on Jacob. And today's story is called Jacob's Dream, and you can read it in your Bible in Genesis 28. And it starts out by saying, Jacob traveled many miles. His uncle Laban lived far away. One night he lay on the ground using a stone for his pillow, and then Jacob fell fast asleep. Jacob was traveling. He was so tired, so he got his rock. He found a rock for a pillow. That probably wasn't too comfy. And he lay down. He went right to sleep. So let's see what happens next in our story. Jacob dreamed of a stairway to heaven. Angels walked up and down. God said, I am watching over you, Jacob. Someday, all of this land will belong to you and your family. There was a staircase, just like these stairs, and they went all the way up to heaven. The angels were going up and down, all the way up to heaven, all the way back down. And then God gave Jacob a promise, saying that he'll always bless him and his family. The next morning, when Jacob woke up, he said, The Lord is in this place. And he took his stone pillow and set it up as a reminder of his dream. And then Jacob praised God. And in the Bible, it also says Jacob was a little scared about that dream. He wasn't too sure about it. And then Jacob continued on his way on his trip. Boys and girls, in this story, our last story, Jacob made Esau and he really mad. He cheated and he lied and that was not kind. So in this one, Jacob's dream, our story today, he was running away. And so even though he was running away from his problems and he wasn't being really nice, God still blessed him and said that all the land would belong to him and his family. So no matter, even when we do bad things, we can ask Jesus to forgive us. And he will always bless us because he loves us no matter what. And I love you guys. And Jesus loves you so much. And I hope you have the best day ever.